Hello guys, it's back with another tutorial. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to make this little light transition where it goes from normal clip to a clip with magic bullet looks light, what, amorphic flares is it? Looks quite cool, a little transition. Right, so first off you want to go and make a new composition. You can copy all my stuff down. Whatever your clip is, choose frame rate. Mine's 59.97. There we go. So you just put your clip in. You want to make two clips. So on the first one, you have to have Magic Bullet Looks plugin for this. For the first one, you're going to go and add a basic color correction. Well, that doesn't look too bad. I'll just add that on just for the sake. And then, right, so find where he gets the kill. This isn't the best clip to show it. So then you want to drag. Drag the one with no color correction on top, and then you want to add magic bullet looks again to the new clip. So it's got no but looks on it. I have a looks file called Dark CC, I think it is. Yeah, this is the one I used. So the flares. You want to add amorphic flare, which is on the side. It's on the lens called anamorphic flares. I'm not actually sure what's it co what it's called. And then you want to go and go to the distort menu, add CC lens to the top layer, the one with the flares. And you want to take the size all the way down to zero. P press keyframe, go forward maybe 15 frames, doesn't matter. Then go to 100. We'll go even more. Just do it until it looks normal. And then I'll RAM preview this. This is really simple. Next tutorial I'll probably do the blue light gun maybe. Oh look you see there in the middle of the screen there's a dot. So we want to open up, press E to open up effects for the layer. So you want to go to it and make it zero. So now it won't appear. So then, yeah, next tutorial will probably be on the glowing gun that I also used in the crump edit. A lot of people want to see that. That will probably be up Sunday or Monday. I think it's half term. We'll be able to do a lot more. There we go. You can do it click, quicker or slower, depending on how fast you want it to be. A little preview here. And then all I did is just add in a, I think it's a swoosh transition. No, swoosh. Is it swoosh? Whoosh, it was one of these. They all sound effects. You want a fast one if it's going fast, if it's going slow, so it goes whoosh, and does it, yeah, me being an idiot here. Right, so then that's it pretty much. So you can just mess around if you want the flares to be a different colour, you go into your magic bullet looks and just mess about with that, change the colour if you want it to be blue, purple, whatever, green. Right, so yeah, leave in the comments what you want to see in the next tutorial. Oh wait, actually I've already said what. Just leave tutorials that you want me to do. If that makes sense. Yeah, if you want to see anything, link me to a video that you want to see. If I can do it, I'll make a tutorial. If you want to watch my last episode, click the annotation in the top left. Click the annotation in the top right to see my next one when it's uploaded. And also... Can you ch please check out my editing team, which is Creative Media. The T is with the the T is a seven in Creative. It's in my box. Some pretty cool people in there. Try to get it to like 200 subs, maybe would be good. I'll leave a link in the description. Also, I've got a video partnered, so I'm going to leave that. One of my tutorials got partnered, so I was quite good. And I'll leave the link in the description so if you go like comment on that that would be really appreciated and yeah I will see you in the next video when it's done Good add sound effect will make it look a lot better the sound effects I used with um, uh, video copilot designer sound effects so yeah I will s that's about it I think Anything I missed, I'll put in the description. Kind of in a rush, so I will see.
see you in the next episode, I guess. Right, bye.